fire and get oh so cold on the inside all right extra jump is nice i don't really see anything i want in there we can test okuto's i don't think it's gonna fire with porcupine backpack but we'll see or acrobatic actually yeah i'm definitely not gonna do acrobatic preparation we can test that another time but not right now Come here, big guy. Oh boy. Alright, I'm gonna try to be quick for the purposes of malaise minimization. Oh man. I just went I just went through there twice. Buffoon. Alright, we've got our two scrolls, which means we can get the hell out of here. And we are going to go promenade again. Surprise, surprise. That one where we died instantly didn't count. Uh-oh. That's a new problem. If I try to... Like, eagerly recycle something. What's up, Murkry? Yeah, we've got this and a Santa outfit. Both of which are quite glorious. What's up, Octave? Nah, it's it's fine. It's it looks chunky, but it's uh it's not very hard to adjust to the visuals of it. I thought the same thing though when I first saw it. What's up, Deca? Indeed, we've got uh, sixteen of these wins so far on Five BC with the Cursed Sword. Uh, the one I just linked to there is on YouTube, and it's got we get every kill door and every time door, so it's a quick one. This is our first time doing it in the 2.1 alpha. So, new malaise, nasty stuff. But yes, we've done a lot of curse sorting. Haha! <clears throat> <laughs> Don't explode me up. Uh, I've died today, but again, uh, I mean, we've done this before 16 times. So. Full run, it's not getting hit. This is our third attempt of the day. The first one was experimental. I was trying to sip, and a biter came to me, but I didn't need to sip. There is a snowman skin in the alpha. It's not uh, in the live patch yet. Yeah, I mean, it's still alpha, so I would imagine this the changes they've made are going to be balanced out over time, uh, and we'll see what they end up deciding, but... Alright. Yeah, good. I didn't want him to get involved. <laughs> Alright, let's get to that promenade door. Goodness. I'm not going to re-roll it. I'm interested to see how this works, but I want Killer Instinct more. We're going to preemptively sip once. Oh. 
and we'll have to hold on to these. Hopefully we'll have 20,000 by ossuary. We do take challenge rifts before the first boss, we won't take them after the first boss. Ooh, I really don't like that part. <clears throat> the prevalence of shield generators in the promenade make it a nightmare with these randomly spawning enemies. Thirty-three more for the kill streak. Twenty-six more. Hey, buddy. <laughs> oh. All right, we're not too far from extra mobs spawning. myself with spikes right now. Holy shit, that almost got me. Well, here we go. It's gonna be spicy. Great. Oh, it's shooting at me right now in the turret. Why? Okay. 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 Sorry for being loud. Holy shit. Get out of here. Got 69 kills. Nice. <laughs> it is stressful. But it's really relaxing when we win. Thor's instinct, show me what I've got. Fragment. Shit, I do kind of want to go straight to the ossuary. <laughs> Me too. I find myself holding my breath on these, and that's not not always the best strategy, since the brain needs oxygen to have a reaction. Spikes. Not fun. Ooh. 
Blow through, blow through. Is this our ossuary? Come on, give me the ossuary. There we go. We're not gonna have 20,000 in the ossuary food shop. That's okay. We're gonna use Porcupine Backpack for funsies since we have this legendary symmetrical lance in there. There we go, a little bit of brute, still an extra jump. That's the amulet I know and love. <laughs> it would be awkward. It'd be very awkward to beat these enemies. Uh, you know what, I'm not re-rolling this thing at all. No way. Uh, we need to hold on to our cash. Cough syrups and stuff. Thank y'all for hanging out. Uh, no, they're actually... So they, they've taken Malays... They've unmarried Malays and mutations, basically. Um, that the mutations, in fact, that used to affect malaise no longer do. So, gastronomy, healing some malaise on boss kill and stuff, that's now just native. Like, we, we always get, or we're supposed to always get malaise reduction on boss kill. Uh, but we don't, because some of them are broken. The problem is, when there's a... Um... Do I what? A punishment? If TN stands for tunes, yes, I I watch cartoons sometimes. I'm guessing that wasn't it though. Uh, I need to find a food shop to get a goodness gracious. A cough syrup, but I don't want to spend a full sip. Oh great, a corpulent zombie. God, let me out. <laughs> oh God. There's no slowing down to get safe, that's for sure. Which is a bummer, because... <laughs> Boy, it's nice to feel safe. Oh god, an elite dark tracker, okay. I would love some cough syrup. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Bye. <laughs> um, no. And if it would, I don't think it would affect the outcome for winning or losing Alkashman. As far as I know, those two color scrolls are absolutely random. 
Um, now, I never believe stuff is absolutely random unless the devs have explicitly said so, and even then, sometimes I don't. But, uh, if you're asking if I want to try to game the system using some kind of, like, urban legend strat, then, no, I don't. I want to pump everything into root when I can, and then survival when I can't. It's a Christmas themed thing. If we can't be red, we'll be green. Wasn't the food? Oh, this might be it. Yeah, this is our food shop. Go get some cough syrup. If only. I, that, that would just mean I had cookies living, so I'd be stoked about that. I must jump down too soon. We've got a guaranteed cursed chest here, in addition to all this... Oh! Cursed sword curse we've already got. Alright. No more randomly spawning enemies. That's good. Uh, because of the infle infection cleared message. That's how we know that. I think. Yep, uh, sorry, that's a good note, actually, what the bot is reminding us of. Um, 24-hour stream is going to be next Thursday, December 17th at 9 a.m. Central U.S. time which is 1,500 hours UTC. It was originally going to be Tuesday, but I had to move it. So it has moved. Officially. Oh, nice, Zenith. Well, happy pre-birthday. Oh, yeah, okay, we're proper cursed. Hello, how you doing? Nice. Is it still, does it still feel the same? Like it's going to be still worth it to go to the doctor, but not, not likely to be a long-term thing. I think that's all urban legend stuff. I believe the thing that, if anything, affects the two color scroll designations, um, it would be what our primary stat is. So, like, our current stat level might affect it, but I don't. 
I'm pretty sure the official watchword from Motion Twin is that it's random. Uh, but officially, challenge rifts are also random, which I don't necessarily believe, because it feels like one run, a run that has one is likely to have more. Oof. Well, I'm sorry. What's the? Did they give you an ETA on recovery time for that? It would. Yeah, we've had some good double damage curse swords in the past on these runs. Uh, not for a while, though. Yeah, we're just fighting through. We just need to make it through safely. Oh god. Don't, 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 don't. Okay, we're right by the door. Okay, nice. That's that's still quite a while, but I was... Horn stuff always scared me, and I picture it being always really lengthy. But I'm glad that you're getting some relief in the meantime. Even if it's temporary. Okay. Well, concierge time, that's a good sign. <laughs> uh, Porcupine Backpack was doing next to nothing, from what I could tell. We were rolling through people with... I guess it's yeah, 61% of our legendary symmetrical lance, and um, they're pretty comparable on a cursed day for me, seeing it. Concierge is more about paying attention and not uh, like lapsing in judgment. Conjunctivius is a more engaged fight where I'm, I'm making a lot more decisions. What's up, Cena? Uh, just choosing our starting loadout is the only mod with custom mode, because we're doing curse swords. What? You don't want to hire me, the pioneer of interdimensional travel, for your interdimensional security position? You're lost, bucko. I already know every hole in your security system, and I'll be selling it on the black space market, looking for five centuries experience when I only started teaching others three centuries ago. For shame. And for Grey Poupon? Uh, yeah, I want open wounds. All right, concierge, let's party. Well, he's got a tiny aura now. That's something. But yes, you know, we just don't want to wait forever to get a uh, curse sword out of the tubes. So I go ahead and force it. <laughs> Holy shit. That was scary. Why you slowed down so much? Oh, uh, somebody you froze because of the end of an effect, I think. Let me out, let me out.
You should die soon. There you go. Uh, yes, Cena. That's what we're doing uh, today. It's Curse Sword. So we, most of the time, we're just running uh, 5BC runs with not custom mode, uh, fully randomized, fully unlocked loot pools, just doing varied runs, typically successfully. Um, but we also do Curse Sword challenge runs on 5BC. So we've got 16 of those wins where we don't get hit on 5BC at all. Um, thank you, Rose. But this is the first time in this alpha patch. But yeah, it'll be all Curse Sword today. Spartan sandals would be hilarious in the backpack, uh, probably, if it actually knocks them back. But, fun fact, uh, if it actually did knock them back that way, that would throw off all the timings and everything. Thank you for the follow. Sorry if I didn't say that out loud. I thought it. All right, to the still village where we can buy a health flask. Thankfully, we've got no malix. Um... I mean, Ooh, thank you. Every little bit <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, Akash. Uh, like I said, uh, concierge is about not making a mental lapse. It's like going through the motions of a successful routine. Kanji is like a, an adaptive fight, uh, but they're roughly equivalent. Thank you, Highwalk. Little room for improvement. You didn't state your thesis clearly enough. Oh my goodness. Okay. Let's not die. But thank you very much for the bits, I want. And again, when I say something is difficult or not, I just mean personally, so. I'm not trying to make overarching statements about the boss one way or another. <laughs> I love all bits. Okay, our malaise is picking up, which means we're gonna have random enemies soon enough, which means we need to be moving. Well, I felt the sentiment still being hurt, Iowa, so it worked. Oh, nice! That's... We're getting there. Well, I appreciate the quest, Taihawk. Okay. Great. Alright, well, he's gonna be nasty. Let's see what his abilities are. We still have an extra jump. We need to keep it moving. Holy shit. Alright, killing that elite removed a fair bit of malaise. Ooh, wee. No, no. Well, I, I don't think of it like that at all. Accomplishment. Uh, I just mean, sometimes there's no, no real rhyme or reason to it. It's the same as the giant, where it's like, Timekeeper, I think, is objectively easier as, a, as far as bosses go, but for whatever reason, the giant's more comfortable. Um, and it's the same kind of deal, where Timekeeper is very routine, and you're, you kind of know what to expect, but giant's more adaptive, but feels... Maybe because it's more adaptive, I feel like more in control in the fight, but... Yeah, that's not that. What's up, Young Fuzzy? I don't. Uh, we actually take challenge rifts if we're before the first boss. We skip them after the first boss. Because there'd be no reason to... Like, I don't want to scrub a run in... The Astrolab or the Sepulcher when we're that close to the end. Um, but quite a few of our wins actually have challenge rifts in them. Including, I think, our Mama Tick route. But definitely our uh, Curse 15. With the. where we got the kill doors and time doors. 
Uh, that that one was challenge drifty. I think we had two. That run was just wacky all around. Well, I can't claim all bravery. It just streams better, young fuzzy. <laughs> if you pass, it's like a compromise. If I passed every challenge drift on fair stays, people would be like, Boo. Get out of here, demolitionist guy. And also, while our malaise is up, I'm sorry, I'm just going to not be able to talk that much. I apologize for that. Oh, man. Oh, my. God. So he won't... He won't have any special abilities. Uh, elites who spawn or get promoted because... God, elites who, who get promoted because of malaise don't have laser abilities. Holy shit. Alright, let's get this shop and buy some cough syrup. And a flask. Holy shit. Now we just need a key and then to get the hell out. <sighs> You're not dead? You're not dead? You're not dead? Please, please die. Okay. There's my key. Flask Dipper removing malaise. Not triage. Because of the new malaise mechanic. Yep, weirded warriors are indeed weird. I think we're gonna get out. Um, no, damn it, we need. Actually, yeah, let's... Well, damn it. Let's try to get Explorer's Instinct. Yeah, it's weird. I was also having to work my way through that when I was coming up with the strategy. One more Squirtle of Power, one more Fragment. Those are easy to nab for the most part. Let's get them and get out. And then into the Sepulchre. Oh god. Who else is over there? Die again? Come on. Come on. Did somebody I just really want this malaise reduction. There we go. Infection cleared. Uh, thank you for the follow. I didn't hear that one. Now let's check your resume. Let's see. You're a corrupted villager, all consumed by a deadly illness, making you hellbent on eradication of all life, or at least the further corruption of all life, and you want to be a cashier? You're in! Spread the love, but also maybe not your malaise, please. We don't have insurance for that. Yet. Whew. Give me the scroll of power. And this fragment. And then we're out. I don't think we have mobs left here. No, we don't. All right, y'all. So far, so good.
All right, it's time to reroll mutations. We're gonna get Gastro in the mix for these sequential boss fights against the giant and then the hand. And I would like enough money to buy a better cursed sword, but that doesn't look like it's going to be happening. Um, we go typically everywhere once during a stream, Fuzzy. But I, at this point, I just mix them up. We just divert paths to make it so that we're going everywhere. <laughs> uh, what's up, King Antonis? It is. Uh, it's part of the new 2.1 Alpha branch. We got a Santa Claus outfit. We got a snowman outfit. Yeah. Also, I would suggest not worrying about how many fragments are in each stage. Uh, having done runs on all paths, thousands of hours of them, uh, the things you can't control are going to control your score count way more than the things you can control. So... Uh, challenge rips, extra curses, all that stuff. Alright, let's get in there. All right, scary place, this sepulcher. Once we start getting a bunch of random spawn-ins, I'm probably gonna sit again. And part of that is because we have a surprising amount of... Dog wiener, what's up? We've got a surprising amount of... Uh... Blask right now. And low malaise. Oh, great. Come in here. You saw me? You didn't see me. Gotta get that light. Nobody's coming? Okay. That didn't seem right. Official curse cleared. Um, ooh. And again, sorry, I'm going to be slower on chat than usual today uh, for probably the whole day. Because it's damn danger. Oh my god. It's true, it's a lovely little blizzard. Invisibility. I could really abuse that. Uh, not gonna. Not in the mood to be that stealthy. I'm gonna wait a minute though and then do a sip. I am also gonna backtrack and kill this bastard. Reason for that is he's got a wall rune next to him that I think, yeah, has cheese in it. Which is now representing 15% extra damage. So, um, even though, uh, as Alapalu pointed out earlier, Gastro off color is kind of a bummer, but, um, you know, if we start stacking the buff, 15% is not nothing. It's equivalent to, like, getting more scrolls. Oh my god, I did not manage that well. I didn't know which way each Dark Tracker was attacking. Uh, and it's hard to read when there's so much noise. Oh 
All right, let's keep running. The hell is up here? Better curse sword. Ah, uh, no. Better Lara. Getting a little expensive. Getting too expensive. Also, this is a dangerous hallway because I don't know if there's enemies in front of me. Okay, never mind. <laughs> there's a blocked door in front of me. We're fine. Thank goodness for permanent lamps. Oh my goodness. Back behind him. That's where we want to be. Uh, darkness does not insta-kill you anymore. It used to in the 1.8. Sorry. It used to in the 1.0 patch. But that has changed. No more. Thankfully. However, darkness, since darkness is affected by, like, double damage and triple damage and all that, um, it's really scary to get darkness damage anyway here with a curse sword, because often we'll have double or increased damage on the sword, which does apply to the darkness, which means one second or so lapse in judgment equals whoopsie poopsie. There we go. Come on. Oh god, I'm in the darkness! Where's my lamp? Okay, here we go, we're taking damage. Holy smokes. <laughs> well, case in point, it doesn't kill us, thankfully. Um, let's see if we can afford a better curse sword. Also, I gotta keep a, keep frosty. Not just because I'm a snowman. I don't trust that enemies aren't gonna spawn for me. Alright, looks like we're headed up here. Yeah, it's hard for me to track by number as well. Uh, I usually do it by feel these days, High Walk, but I agree, it does feel pretty good. Right now. And sorry I'm so slow on chat, we're now in the extensive focus portion of the stream. Up and over. That's it. Up and over and we're out of here. Boom. And we have 30% extra damage right now. Let's get in this giant fight. Alright. This is where things really pick up on a cursed run. Uh, we have giant right into Hand of the King. Uh, right into the Astro Lab, so... Here we freaking go. Oh, God.
I don't even know. Thank you, High Log. It's not going to matter here. None of none of the mutations is really going to matter a ton except blind faith. Let's go. Get him? Yes! <sighs> Woof. Ooh. Thank you. Alright, hand time. Holy shit. We're gonna head into the hand with uh, 29, 27 uh, brutality. We'll have plenty of damage, but that's that'd be kind of on the lower end. Oh boy! Can make her sword. Oh, oh, oh! Double aura. It causes bleed and does extra damage to bleed. Thank you, accomplishment. Thank you, Decca. <laughs> that is an incredible aura, yeah. I didn't even know it could get both make the victim bleed and extra damage to bleed. But that's a it's a good find. I'm happy with that. Okay, let's let's re-roll the one that's making enemies freeze at the end. I don't want that, man. That's just We don't need that. Yeah, it's gonna be a bigger blizzard, Iowa. Alright.
Yes. <gasps> wow. That <laughs> took it out of me. Dude, that was a that was a fight. Shit. It's true, Cena. Claret! Thank you, and what's up? Holy moly. That was intense. Uh, there were several times I almost botched that. Right at the end when he did his dash, I almost... Yeah, that was... I'm pleased with how that went, but we're not done yet. We got Astrolab to clear. Um, we've got... We got the big man himself to fight, but that's good. Uh, if this were a 4VC run, we would have won. That doesn't mean anything, because it's not, and we haven't. <sighs> you know what? I'm not, I'm not even re-rolling. Actually, Gastro might be worth it. Even though I'm spending money... Yeah, that's so expensive. Probably worth it in the end, because uh, uh, based on how low that damage was on the hand, uh, the collector's gonna last forever. Thank you for the follow. Uh, Oime, the snowman is part of this alpha build, so if you're a Steam player playing on PC, you can opt into this alpha for the 2.1 patch, and the snowman and a Santa outfit, several skins are already unlocked for you. Um, Ooh. If you're on console or you play on PC through a means other than Steam, unfortunately, you wouldn't have access to it yet. <laughs> huh. I'm glad, accomplishment. That's the goal. Holy moly. Alright, let's keep it alive. Oh my god, I almost fell in a pit for my... Just first move. Good God. All right, I am gonna sip. Preemptively. We have a food shop guaranteed here. So if we can find it, we'll have access to cough syrup as well as another health flask. Uh, they'll be expensive though. Also, I can go ahead and recycle this. Oh, you're good, Hiwog. I appreciate the thought in the first place. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm gonna be eyes focused here. Uh, we gotta make it because time is of the essence because of our malaise. Um, there's so many reasons why we have to be on point here, so I just can't look at chat, I'm sorry. Ugh. Okay, here comes this guy. Extra jump at long last. Holy moly. That's what I wanted. And now our malaise is low again. <laughs> Do I? Wonder why that could be. Yeah. It's not unfamiliar territory, but it's always scary every time, which is why we continue to do it. Alright, when we find our second shop, we'll have access to our cough syrup. Um, hmm. Also, King of Tonus, let's, uh, you know, like, what, what's the point of saying that? Let's keep it positive. 
Hey, bro. Don't mess up. Thank you. Oh! No! I messed it all up. I wouldn't, I didn't want to be there, but, ah. Oh. I didn't think, I didn't think the right way.